you don't make many friends in prison, much less those of the four-legged variety. The positive approach program has been invaluable to um, just making some excellent guide dogs. Offenders at Dominguez State Jail train guide dogs that will go on to serve the visually impaired. These are guys that are really trying to um, turn their, their selves around. The offenders must have a special clearance that allows them to live with the dogs and make trips outside the prison. So yeah, so. The advantages to having the inmates do it is they actually have more time to spend with the dog. So much time, the dogs are house trained within mere days. They don't have as many distractions and therefore can focus on the dog itself. 14-year-old program shifted directors recently and the prison got a new warden less than four months ago. I first arrived at the facility and I saw the actual responsibility that it brought upon the offender there in the housing area and how they were distinguished to provide new training for the dogs. They really changed the lineup about the whole thing. Senior warden Miguel Martinez walked a guide dog with a blindfold to understand the training his offenders go through. You know, the dogs that they train, just knowing that the amount of hours that gets put onto these dogs as far as training and then them going to the owner, it's yeah. just amazing. An amazing program he thinks could be used in Those other places. Nice. I feel that uh, other entities of the Texas Department of Criminal Justice can gain from providing this service back to the community and to that rightful owner. So he Bailey McGowan reporting. Tapped.